What? Hogwarts Legacy, Episode 3 <laughs> They are physical, these hints? Oh. You cannot be serious. Goblins working with Rookwood makes no sense. It is rather unorthodox, to say the least. Unorthodox? It's inconceivable. It's... Ah, Fig. You have a visitor. I'll see what I can find out. Very hmm. organic. Sir, I was able to search the restricted section while you were with Professor Black. It was a book we were after. What? That's... Wait. You accessed the restricted section? But how? Thinking on it, perhaps it's best you spare me the details. Fair enough. In fact, the book was below the restricted section, as it appeared on the map. I want to hear everything. First, let's have a look. Oh. Oh dear. Some of these pages seem to be missing. It appears someone has got to the book before us. Still. Why didn't they keep it then? I will need time to study what remains. Perhaps we can still salvage something useful, though it may take some time. I wonder why it was here, below Hogwarts. I think I know, sir. I saw two more memories where I found the book. Another pensive, Godric's heart. The man we saw before, Percival Rackham, was a professor here. The first memory showed him and three other professors using ancient magic to restore a hamlet from a drought. Miriam was right. And the second memory? In the second, they were talking to a student who started as a fifth year, like I did. She could see traces of magic, too. Why those memories? Hmm. Perhaps this book will explain. Now I'll have to take it with me to London. The headmaster has insisted that I speak directly to the minister about George's death. What will you tell them about Mr. Osric's death? I don't know how much I dare say. George tried to convince the Ministry about Ranrock, but to no avail. My instinct is to follow the path we are on for the moment and keep the details to ourselves until we know more. I understand. I'll see what I can learn about the missing pages while you're gone. Good. Don't neglect your studies. Your wand work is improving by the day. But you'll want to pay attention in herbology and potions. Oh. There's more to magic than spell casting. Plenty to keep me occupied while you're gone. You've done exceptionally well. I look forward to seeing all that you've accomplished when I return. Oh, and don't neglect your friends. You may be surprised by how much you can learn from them as well. Meet me in Lower Hogsfield as soon as possible. I would like to talk to you about Rookwood and Harlow, and it might be best to do so outside of the castle. Uh -huh. Like I said, the green stuff, you have been there, you have seen it. Otherwise, not so much. Hmm. 
Lower Hawksfield. Professor Fig and Weasley have asked that I teach you an additional defensive spell. Please complete the assignments I have given you, and then proceed to see me in my classroom. What are these good for? Legendary cape. I mean, the amount of clothes you're getting here, I kind of think that you're supposed to play this as a girl character. Yes, yes, yes. Oh. This spell removes weapons from your foes. Expelliarmus. I wonder if we can remove teeth from from a, from some wolf or whatever <laughs> guess not oh Professor Hikat wants me to practice avoiding attacks by dodge rolling. She also wants me to cast Incendio on a few enemies. My field guide will not guide me through this assignment, but my map could still prove useful. In other words, out in the field. Oh, I'm sorry. <clears throat> Huh. Oh, reconsider. Revelia. Still don't have the spell to unlock stuff. I'd better keep an eye on high places around the school for Zenobia's gobstones. Wonder if I can fly eventually. Oh, what's this? Um, Let me it's 
small adjustments. Oh my god, I won the lottery! Hmm. I'd better keep an eye on high places around the school for Zenobia's gobstones. Oh, um... Can't find the exit? Hmm. Just teleport there, I guess. It is good to see you, my friend. How are you? I hope you've recovered from our rather eventful trip to Hogsmeade. I am well, but I have been worried about you, my friend. With Ranrock and Rookwood and Harlow after you? I'm alright at the moment. We did not speak about it at the time, but I am hoping now you might tell me why they were looking for you. I've never met Rookwood or Harlow. Perhaps they mistook me for another student. Hmm. A bit odd, the two of them pursuing a Hogwarts student so intently. But whatever the reason, you were clearly in danger. For now, it is safe to say that Rookwood and Harlow are a threat to both of us, to all of us. Which is why I wanted to speak to you. I realized something that day in Hogsmeade. You displayed such courage fighting that troll, and Sorona wasn't intimidated one bit by Rookwood and Harlow. Both of you have inspired me to take a stand of my own. What sort of stand? Men like Rookwood and Harlow are the reason my mother and I left Matibili land. I am not going to sit by and watch them destroy my new home. Rookwood and Harlow are a dangerous pair on their own. And the fact that they're working with Ranrock, well... All the more reason they must be stopped. Rumor has it that Theophilus Harlow runs Rookwood's day-to-day -day operations. Taking him down would cripple Rookwood's entire enterprise. That may be true, but shouldn't Officer Singer handle someone like Harlow? I spoke with her. She was polite, but perhaps understandably would not discuss details with a student. I overheard some of Rookwood's lot talking about a massive poaching operation that Harlow is planning. I was thinking that we could investigate a bit, try to get the evidence that Officer Singer needs. All right, but how? I am going to watch and listen and find out precisely what Halo is up to. I shall reach out when I know more. In the meantime, remember, I am here if you need me. Thank you, Natty. Be on your guard. I beg your pardon. How dare you threaten me? What's going on here? If you're here for my wares, I'm afraid I still don't have my carts. Yeah, well, I haven't done that yet, so sorry. And while we're at it, I do have some stuff that I can wear. Mm -hmm. Protective stuff.
incredible increase. Should be a spell, incredible increase. <laughs> And wasn't there someone here to whom I could sell some stuff, so that I have some inventory space? Hello, Mr. Semi. What can I do for you? What do you have for sale? What can I help you with today? That should be enough for now. I hope to see you again sometime. Yep, surely to sell stuff. Incendio. They must have come this way. Think. Two threatening minions. I've no idea who it is you think I might have seen. I've been busy Dark with Withers. my research. I do not have time to... Victor Rookwood don't give a doxy's nip back your time. Oi! Speak of the devil. Mr. Rookwood would like a word with you. A student! You can't be so... <laughs> Enough out of you. Leave her alone. Stupefy! Incendio! Oh! Uh oh. I'll watch the light go out of your eyes. Oh shit. But it wouldn't be realistic to get out the field guy and read about the enemy now that the enemy just occurred. Happened. I've never been accosted in such a manner. Then so close to Hogwarts. Honestly, one third of that was luck. <sighs> Are you all right? <sighs> I am, thanks in no small part to your excellent defensive skills. Care to tell me why two Ashwinders were ready to dispatch me to get to you? Ashwinders? Victor Rookwood's thieves and extortionists, his little cronies. They seemed quite keen on you. It's a long story, huh? but thank you for your help. Hmm. Well, you've avoided them for the moment. Priya warned me things were getting dangerous. Best get moving on my research before they return. You mentioned someone named Priya. Yes, my wife. She's the one who piqued my interest in Merlin. Gave me a book when we were students at Hogwarts. 
Typical hard-working Hufflepuff, brilliant potioneer, has her own shop in Nocturne Alley. She's a travelling vendor. Here's what's going on in the Highlands before I do. Probabilities, people. The reasons why you put that in a game or in a story or in a book. The reasons are what this is about. That is what the debate is about. That. Understand it. The reasons why you put that in there. Not that it is in there, you fucking idiots. You're a researcher. Nora Treadwell at your service. Historian and archaeologist specializing in Merlin's work and life. I thought that Merlin and the tales about King Arthur's court were mere myth. Mere myth? <laughs> You're lucky Sir Cadogan didn't hear you. Chatters on endlessly about his connection to Merlin from his portrait at Hogwarts. Merlin attended Hogwarts, you know, and I'm studying some curious fixtures he left here centuries ago. Fixtures? These vine-covered pillars, dozens of them all around the area. I've taken to calling them the Trials of Merlin. I believe he created them as a diversion for his fellow Slytherins. <laughs> he was terribly fond of puzzles and enigmas. I can see why you're so interested in Merlin. I'd be keen to know more about the trials. Well then, I'll let you in on a little secret. No one has yet managed to figure out how they work. But I believe I have just unlocked a crucial clue. I suspect that Mallow Sweet is an important component in getting the trials to work. Mallow Sweet? Versatile herb. Merlin repeatedly mentioned it in his writings. I had just arrived to test my theory when I was so rudely interrupted. You see, each swirl in Merlin's writing has a symbol in the center. That started me thinking, what if the Mallow Suite is meant to be placed at the center of the symbols? Precisely. Would you care to do the honors? We can see what comes of our little hypothesis. I brought a trunk chock full of Mallow Suite with me. It's just over there by my tent. This trunk? Yes, take plenty, even if you already have some. I have the Mallow Suite. Lovely. Now, notice the vines on these pillars here, as well as a stone swell on the ground. Each trial has these features. Place the Mallow Suite on the swell, and we'll see what happens. See that? The vines disappeared. What should I do now? Hmm. Rebellion. This is uncharted territory. I am curious about these pyres. Pyre, you say? Beard. The flames make the pyre sink. Okay, has to be at the same time. All right. Let me guess, you walk in, you raise a whole level. <laughs> I take it we can call that a success. We can indeed. However, I now have even more questions. How does it work? I must review my notes. I may have missed something. Are all of the trials like this one? Hmm? Oh, not precisely. Well, I think each has those telltale vines and the swell on the ground. You should feel free to solve them as you come across them. I believe I have what I need to continue my research. 
My guess is that each will also require mallow sweet, which you can find in Hogsmeade should you need more. I really must be off. Such a pleasure to meet you. And do be careful out here. Now, I've got what I needed. I shall return to the safety of my notes and books. I guess that was a oh, I guess that was a coincidence that the level raised right there. <clears throat> hey, what's that? There's a chest on the map. my wares. I'm afraid I still don't have my carts. Spider lamb. I can now burn webs. <clears throat> Speaking of burn, I burned through all my health stuff. Hey, Mr. Dude, sir, do you have some, maybe? Hello, Mr. Semi. What can I do for you? What do you have for sale? What can I help you with today? Indeed. Ah, yes, a wonderful choice. A potion that enhances the drinker's defense. The drinker approved! <laughs> I guess. I hope to see you again sometime. Hmm, red arrows. I assume this insinuates the opposite of friendliness. Wasn't there something about hiding myself? I think so. Hmm. This one. No. Oh, spiders. Two spiders. Level 11. Let me guess their scale. <sighs> Never mind.
Put away the wand. Or not. If you would have grown up with computer graphics like I have, then you would look at this with different eyes, I guess. I mean, the first graphics I saw were 128 pixels wide and 48 pixels high, green and black. And not much animation going on. Not that fast yet. But this, this is not normal. Sometimes we have to realize we're sitting in a chair in the sky. Oh, that's convenient. Don't even have to go there. Where the fuck? Where is it? Oh, they're still damaged. Fold here a deadly great spider. Sure. Clothes. What else can you find in this game? That's a high mountain.
No bunny hopping. What might this be? Looks like something with fire and stars. Complete landing platform, all I had to do was climb up there. Or is this supposed to be a land there once I can fly? Hmm. Sounds the way here. Did it, did it even hit anything?
뭐야? 뭐지 칸디 브라운 스파이더 Are you asleep or something? I said burn. Might this be? Is this something I have to break through with fire or by tossing this thing in? Incendio. Well, not the former. Was oh, this for climbing up? Oh, 
I am now poisoned. Hmm. Will this keep going? No. of 20 spiders for this challenge. Oh, this thing seems interesting. What is this? Necessary. Open right now. It is. This looks intriguing. Nice touch with the whispering. I 
Let me guess, a level, a level 11 hat is waiting for me to be discovered? Perfect school uniform. This is lame, seriously. Why would I go through these intriguing mysteries only to find very mildly, slightly different standard clothes? I mean, that's just stupid. So this cannot be upgraded, 16 defense. This can be upgraded, 16 defense. How do we even upgrade stuff? Oh, that's much more. Not half bad. Jump already. Dude, I made you dead. Do you not remember that? That's stupid. I mean... Respawning enemies are one thing, but then respawning only five minutes after I've been here and have not died and reloaded the game, that is lame. That sucks. There should be some persistence. that this okay um that is probably just the end of reality hmm So this is where you draw the line. this huh whatever it is oh they have some solution for that I got I was stuck but there's some stuck detector the way it's meant to be
That's more than double. What are these? Merlin. Could it be the Merlin trial? Why well, the things from the tent cannot be moved here? I don't know. Huh. Oh, another one? Revelia. There's another one. Incendio.
Oh, I must have hit. Uh, this is probably not supposed to be traversed. What shit? Rimmed Spectacles, level 5. Mm -hmm. hmm. Charming school cloak. It might be magical in a different way. Hmm. Very generic. dog with a car. I wouldn't even know what to do with one if I cha if I chased the... Uh, what the fuck? I caught one. <laughs> Jump already. This is feasible. Ah, Levitatus. Ah. Oh. Oh, that worked with five quotation marks on both sides of the word. <coughs> It's been a bit grim, I won't deny, but the tides will turn for us soon. No. Oh. I thought they were civilized. Well, if you weren't so forgetful, we'd probably have more, wouldn't we? Can never have too many sacks, my friend. I'd rob my own father if there were galleons in it. Not my mother, mind. Hmm. <sighs> Let's see what's up your sleeve this time, Merlin. They don't seem to care for me in Hogsmeade. Can't say I blame them, what with all I've done there. I may go to Hogsmeade later, stir up some trouble. They need to be reminded that we're still running things. If you owe me galleons and you can't pay, you best get it to. I shall be having none of your nonsense. Potato! That was an incendio! Explosive! What kind of magic? You're dead. The trip here goes to a palace! Real quick, don't go down easy.
No! Ah, shit. Sometimes a mouse needs cleaning. Crap, how do I get back up there? Levitate an Ashwinder soldier to disrupt their explosive cast. Seriously, you're telling me there's no way? Dude! Ugh. This is not the way. There's no way back. Just because I hit the wrong key one moment. Damn it. No way back. This sucks big time. the end of the world. What is it? Oh, oh. It was the end. Ah, maybe I spawn nearby. I mean, the alternative would have been to go to a flame, and where would that have been? Far, far away. Ah, shit. Guess what? I managed to miss all the flames. I mean, there is no way back here, is there? Hmm. to go somewhere else. Let's go here. Isn't there the Forbidden Forest nearby? What?
What are you up to now? I am trying to identify what insanity is this. God damn it. This area has been declared dangerous by the Ministry of Magic. Hmm. Don't mind if I do. It doesn't care. more to hear myself. Maybe I should take those herbology classes so I can make that stuff myself. Revelia. Spiders. Ah. 
Yeah, I'm doing it wrong. Do a list, that sounds dangerous. This guy, however, doesn't seem dangerous. He's just walking in place. So that's what a tracker is. A tracker creates tracks on the ground. Ah. Okay, uh, it seems dangerous. Who uh, are wrong key, I guess. Estimated you. Someone's going to recognize. I think my body is. I move. What the fuck? Huh. Was it some kind of sp petrification spell? I don't think so. Something must have been wrong. <sighs> I you! What is okay. it you're doing? I'm bring us. You'll feel that tomorrow. Huh? <laughs> you last that long. No! Hang on! Bella next time! Did I hurt you? Yeah, spawning there hurt me. Is that the best you Is 
Destruction of three. What are you telling me? <laughs> One. Is this a thing? This could prove dangerous if I'm not careful. Slippery, slippery. This looks like a one way street. Sure, if I want to go in there. What? Curiosity killed the cat. I mean, the rewards in this game are just ass. Perhaps I shall scout around Fellcroft for something to poach. Let me guess. A poacher? You can feed a beast, or it can feed you. I prefer the latter. It's been ages since I've found anything worth... <laughs> Might I remind everyone that a wizard's sharpest tool is his mind? Perhaps best to shun that which leads it astray.
Vamos. Schoolgirl just killed 10, 20 people. They're just humans, minds who lived for 20, 30, 40 years, driving through the world, learning things, having love affairs, and being assholes, of course, but nonchalantly just offing people left and right. Hmm. <laughs> Waterfall? Yep. This is up and nonsense. I've never heard that rubbish in all my life. I think I get more sense out of moon car stuff. Seven of ten. Mongrel fur. Dude, Team Edward all the way. <laughs> Hey Google, turn on the fan. To me, they'll rest in ten graves. Selling the poach in Aaron's shirt can be fine. Not worth the trouble if you ask me. <laughs> I swear, none of you'd have a head left on your shoulders if you didn't have me keeping you in check. Now, where did I set my traps? They have become but a footnote. I've raided Brockborough more times than I can count. They're Did you? Capable of defending themselves. I've used unforgivable curses on occasion. <laughs> Fortunately, I'm not looking to be forgiven. Everyone in Upper Hogsfield shudders when they see me coming, and rightfully so. Wonder if the map's helpful for you.
Who killed the troll? No traps, it appears. When will I ever see a flame again that I can light? A waypoint to travel to. Niffler. Is this a female Niffler? What does this mean? Croft. Hope I never have to see it again. I've robbed every traveling vendor that's passed through here. They never see it coming. Where did you put the loot? I'd be interested in knowing that information. Oh, so tired. <laughs> You've made a grave mistake. Grave, you say? That looks like a special place. Oh.
Dude. They're like three and a half meters where you can go in here. And on these three and a half meters, they forgot to set this invisible wall right. Shame. Why am I even here? I guess I lack the proper spell. Alright. I know what that means. Merlin trial. I don't know. At least I discovered the rotation again. That seems mildly more than I can stomach. I've used the dark art several times. Can't understand why I'm more dead. Why can't I take this? This is weird. Oh, multiple even. Assassin. These are level 20. I'm not level 20. I'm level 11. That would be suicide. <laughs> hey, why is that guy so marked? Let's find a flame.
Let's get this over with, shall we? I have things to do. Rookwood waiting for. I'm a master at this. A master. I don't waste time seeing if they're dead. Their fate's not on my hands. Only their blood. What?
Pleasant surprise. I think I can pull that off.
A new hat. New glasses. I mean, can tell me what you want. This game isn't fully developed. They made it round, but this... Seriously, I mean... You get better and better with spells and all of that, and all of that only to get better glasses or something? That's completely underdeveloped, man. Oh, I have to be level 12 to get these. I wonder if using the fire spell on the web is the solution of the problem. Throwing spiders at me now, I get it. That explains the name, too. Oh, do you see that? Complete the battle without using the health potion. That was a special challenge here. Huh.
What? Dude, are you a spider lover? What is this? Betting on the dragon fights was the best decision I've made yet. I didn't always like a polite battle. Help me! Level 20, should have known. Hogwarts is very lucky they've got protection charms, if you ask me. They come after me. I'll stick them like a nogtail. It's a better you've made a mistake! Run it home! <laughs> What have you done? Ah, oh, shit. <laughs> they would see me.
hit upon. I know your face now! It should have been enough, right? I mean, didn't this professor dude say, Ah, you need to train a little bit in the field and then I can teach you. I think... oh. Oh, I've been here from the other perspective, yeah. Nuisance when supplies run low, though. Always makes me nervous when our stocks aren't brimming. Huh? Somebody out there. I'm tripping, I can't tell it! <laughs> had enough! I can't Oh uh, no. Knew you would recover. Finished. A trip us to Fight for me. Okay, level 20 is a bit high. So let's go back to school. Or let's take that herbology class. Well, let's see what it is then. Lumos. Hello. I don't believe we've met. Oh, hello. I'm Lenora. Pardon me if I seem a little distracted at the moment. Everyone thinks I'm utterly balmy. Samantha thinks I'm potty. But it's this painting. I never noticed it before. If I know Hogwarts, and I do, an empty frame doesn't appear for no reason. There's something more to this. Have you gained any insights about the painting since you've been studying it? I did discover that casting Lumos has an effect of some kind. But I'm not sure what to do next. Exactly my problem. Are there other empty paintings like this around the school? Yes, a few. This entire place is somewhat of a riddle, to be honest. If I can work out the riddle of this one, I'll know what to do with all of them. As good a place as any to begin. If I have the time, I may look. Could be intriguing. <sighs> I've been racking my brains long enough. I hope you'll have better luck than I have. Do come and find me if you stumble on something illuminating Lumos. that solves the mystery. That spot must be a clue. I should look around in case it's nearby.
dragon in the background. I really have made a mess of things. Incendio! Level 12. Is everything all right? Oh, hello. Thank you for asking. I'm Cressida, by the way, and I'm afraid everything's not all right. I may be in a spot of trouble with the librarian. You see, I'm fond of creating my own charms. Thought I'd perfected my light as a feather charm to use on my library books. My arms get so tired carrying them around all day. But I must have confused the Latin word for feather with bird in my incantation, because when I opened my bag just now in the library, they literally took flight. Oh, that sounds brilliant, actually. Thank you. Somehow I don't think the librarian will see it that way. I collect the books and remove the charm myself, except this isn't the first time one of my charms has threatened the peace of the library. Our meat told Madame Scribner they were my books flying around, so she said that if I caused her any more trouble, she'd write to my parents. Perhaps you could get them for me. There are only five. She won't be suspicious of a new student looking around. Why did our meat tell Madame Scribner that they were your books? Oh, to be perfectly honest, I don't think he meant any harm. I think he was impressed. Bragging on my behalf. Amit spends a lot of time gazing at the stars, but he knows a good charm when he sees one. I suppose I could help if I have the time. Oh, I'd very much appreciate it. One of the books is my diary. I'd rather it not fall into the wrong hands. If you could collect them and bring them to me, I can remove the charm. Hmm. No dragon like statue to be found. a leather flat cap my god this is so disappointing all these secrets only serve for you to find the secrets but not to enjoy what you've found shame I shall definitely feign a bit of dragon pox for. Revelio. If I had to pick a favorite professor, Handy. 
handy resource indeed, your field guide. I'm most pleased to be included. But when is Professor Amanda? Oops. What the fuck? Pavelio. I <laughs> challenge the mountain troll. Stairwell looks promising. Lumos. This looks like the portrait from the map. Now, where's the treasure? Oh. Was a doorway hidden within the portrait. Oh, dude. What is this thing good for? I wonder what came of Arthur's search.
Oh, what happened to you? Revelia. Bombarda. I'm going to have to use Akio to get to those books. Akio! Got it. Only four more to go. Two more. You can't imagine how inconvenient travel was before I invented flu powder. That's the last book. Now to take them back to Cressida. Hey you. Hello, Cressida. I collected your books, including your diary. Oh, what a relief! Thank you. I'll happily take the heavy lot off your hands now. Here you are. Well, lesson learned. I certainly won't be practicing any charms in the library again anytime soon. Now, to work out where I went wrong. Perhaps I should start brushing up on my Latin. Thank goodness some people are trustworthy. Certainly wouldn't want anyone but me reading my diary. Rebellion. 
Nothing beats a leisurely evening flight. And now the rave is on her way. happened <laughs> it's just a flesh wound hey wait a minute no not that Missed opportunity. I'd like to see your parents' faces when they see your father. Wow. <laughs> Impressive. Level 13.
My gear slots are fucking full. Excuse me? It is lost? Are you fucking fucking shitting me? Seriously? This probably kind of unique chest thing? You lose that when you don't have an empty inventory slot? Damn. That's just the worst kind of game design. The worst kind. Shake's head. One, morning, one minute 47. Yeah, that's alright. That's been enough for today.